references to a forger named Fade in CSEC crime reports, Shepard. Perhaps that is a good place to start looking. Also, according to CSEC, a drill recently passed through customs. The CSEC office may have more information. I'm sorry, sir, but I'll need you to remove any biotic amp you might be wearing. What? Why? Unfortunately, sir, biotics can be used as a weapon. The rules require me to confiscate all amps. Could you please hand over yours? I don't have one. I'm not a biotic. Oh. Well, when you objected, I thought... You humans are all racist. You'd think Citadel security would be the tightest in the galaxy. I know C-Sec, too. That's right. I see no fewer than 14 fatal flaws a skilled assassin could exploit. Eight of them existed when I was here ten years ago. Yes? I'm trying to find a local forger. He goes by the name of Fade. Yeah, I know him. The alias, anyway. He's been a thorn in the network division's side for the last year. He works with the Blue Suns. Where can we find him? Yeah, if I knew that, he'd be in a cell. Best I can do is put you on the trail. There's a warehouse in the marketplace. Some of Fade's contacts work out of there. Go ask them some questions. Gently, of course. Why haven't you been able to catch him? Whoever he is, he's damn good at avoiding CSEC. I think someone on the inside's feeding him information. Either that, or he's got access to our databases and comm channels. I don't know which is worse. But you're outside, CSEC. Maybe you can nail his ass. I should be going. You need anything else, let me know. Yes? My associate's trying to find his son. We think a local criminal may have hired him. That should be easy. We don't see many drill here. There we go. One of my men reported a drill recently. And he was talking to Mouse. Interesting. Mouse? Ah, petty criminal. Probably not the guy who hired your boy, but a messenger. He's a former duct rat. Runs errands for anyone who'll pay. What sort of trouble has Mouse been getting himself into? Odd jobs for shifty people. Duct rats take whatever is available to get by. Data running, fencing stolen goods, selling illegal VI personalities. Actually, he was selling one of you. Me? Yeah, when you erased a file, it would say, I delete data like you on the way to real errors. That's pretty extreme, Commander. Laugh it up, Garrus. Buggy, though. It crashed every half hour. The error message was about how the galaxy was at stake, and you should fix the problem yourself. What was it you called, Mouse? A duct rat. It's a local slang for the poor kids who grow up in the station. When they're small, they tend to play in the ventilation ducts where adults can't get to them. Aren't the ducts dangerous? Every couple of months, we pull a little body out of them. Lacerated by fan blades, broken by a deadfall, suffocated by vacuum exposure. Those are just the ones we know about. More just disappear. Maybe they get sucked into space. Maybe they fall into the protein vats the Keepers run. The mouse survived long enough that he can't fit in the ducts anymore. He was one of the smarter ones, or the luckier ones. I've heard enough. The mouse is usually upstairs outside the Dark Star. He works out of a public comm terminal. You should pick up a copy of the Shepard VI when you talk to him. It sounds like your boy's running with the wrong crowd. Yes, I agree. If Mouse can't get you in touch with your son directly, he'll know who can. I'll help you if you need it. You don't know us, Captain. Why are you going so far to help us? I've worked at Kara for two years. Every day kids turn to crime because they've got no other choice. Because their parents don't care. You're trying to save yours. He faces a dark path. We better hurry, then. You didn't tell him that Kolyat plans to assassinate someone. I also didn't tell him what you do for a living. Do you normally discuss assassinations with the police? I take your point. This is Thank my you, favorite Shane. store on the Citadel. Yeah, yeah, sure. I can get you two cases by the end of the day. You mouse? What are you... Oh, shit. Krios. I thought you retired. Commander Shepard? I, I thought you died. What do you want with me? Be still, mouse. You can change your pants in a moment. 
How do you know Thane? Krios? He didn't... If he didn't say nothing, I ain't either. When we heard the name, I didn't think it could be the same mouse. He was a contact on the Citadel when I was active. He and some other children would gather information on my targets. You put children in danger to spy for you? Children, the poor. My people's word for their kind is Dralafa, the ignored. They're everywhere, see everything. Yet they are never seen. You gave another Drell instructions for an assassination. Who's the target? I, I don't know. I didn't ask. Because the people I work for... We don't have time for this. Oh, God, Thane, help me. Help me, Mouse. My son is out there, in the dark. That's why I cared for him. I thought you'd want me to. Please. Explain. He came in, said he was looking for work. He had a hollow of me, the, the one you took, Krios. I put the word out. Use your old contacts. Elias wanted to hire him. Elias Kellum. One other thing. That Shepard VI you're selling? Oh shit, you heard- Look, you were dead. It was totally legal to make a VI of you. You made money using my likeness. I think I deserve some of the profits. Don't you? Oh, sure. How about I just transfer some money to you? I mean, you why bother with all the lawyers and taxes and junk, huh? One other thing. That Shepard VI you're selling? Sorry if the cut seems small. It's Vola software. They like to sell cheap, but in bulk. Tell me about Kellum. Human. Moved to the Citadel about ten years ago. He was little people when you were here, Krios. He got big after the Geth attack. Lots of the big guys from before got cacked, all in them big fancy apartments up on the Presidium. Now he runs the rackets on the lower end of the ward. Shin Akiba. He's seriously bad news. You just saved yourself a world of pain, kid. Yeah, right. When Kellum finds out what I've done, I won't live long. And I can't do anything about it but hide. Krios, you got any kindness for me? Put a bullet in Kellum before you go. That couldn't have been easy. Mouse knew more about my life than Kolyat ever did. He smiles up at me, broken teeth and scabby knees. Bare feet black. A dead-end future, looking up at me, worshipping the petty gifts I offer. I was the only good thing he had back then. But I left him, as I left Kolyat. Mouse said you had a hollow of him. Yes. A foolish bit of sentimentality. I can perfectly recall every moment I spent with Mouse. He pulls at my arm. Smiles. He wants to know that I'll remember him. That anyone will remember him. I take the hollow. He smiles at himself in miniature on my palm. Then a frown crinkles his brow. He pats my pockets, checking for other hollows. Where's your son, Krios, he asks. Don't blame yourself. If I don't, who will? We must carry the weight of our decisions, Shepard. You, people know this. Let's head back to Bailey. Yes? Can we talk about my associate's son? You talked to Mouse? Did you get the name of the guy he's working with? Elias Kellum. Kellum? Oh, shit. Ah, look, this is awkward. Kellum and I have a, an agreement. He doesn't cause too much trouble and buys tickets to the CSEC charity ball from me. In return, I ignore him. You want to accept bribes? Fine. I don't care how you run your precinct. I want to know if you're gonna help me. Yeah, I'll help. Absolutely. I'll get some of my people to bring him in and set him up in a private room. You can interrogate him yourself. I'll stay out of sight. And if I'm lucky, Kellum will believe that I had nothing to do with it. Bring him in. We might not have much time. 
I'll make it happen. Wait here. We've got Kellum. Tell Bailey we're ready. He'll expect me to get him out of this. Not today, I think. Captain, his lawyer's here. Ben Elias has his VI set to page him if CSEC gets within 10 meters. I'll stall him. Get in there and work fast. We should question him together. Keep the pressure on. Thoughts on how we approach it? You talk to him. Appeal to his self-interest. I'll put the screws to him if he needs it. Very well. I'll pretend to be on his side. But if we waste too much time negotiating, Bailey won't be able to stall Kellum's advocate. Get me out of these restraints, Bailey. Pretty funny bringing me down here like this. What the hell are you two? You ordered a hit on someone. You're gonna tell me who. The only person I'm talking to is my advocate. Here's how it works. I ask a question, you answer the question. You speak when you're spoken to. Who the fuck do you think you are, bitch? Mr. Kellum, I don't believe you were paying attention. Nice. You just handed me your job. Hit me again and I'll take your money, too. I'm gonna straighten you out. As soon as Bailey gets here. Just tell us what we need to know. My associate isn't very patient. What are you, frog boy? A little sidekick? What, kid? You gonna bore me into confessing? You ain't shit. Come on, hit me. Works for me. No! Oh! Do you know what I'll do to you when I get out of here? Keep it up, tough guy. You'll leave in a bag. Go to hell. He's up. He's no use to us dead. Are we done here? Because I got people to see. I'm done being patient. Give me a name or I'll cut your balls off and sell them to a Krogan. Joram! Joram Talid. Dorian in the 800 box. He's unconscious. No need to wake him up, I think. I'm not shedding any tears. Not over the likes of him. I'd hope to avoid unnecessary bloodshed. Pure results come from pure methods. I worry about what is yet to come. What's the story? Why'd Kellum hire the boy? Assassination. A Turian named Joram Talid. You know him? Joram? Yeah. You might have seen his posters around. He's promising to end organized crime on the ward. Thing is, his message is all mixed up in race politics. He's anti-human. Are things so bad that people can openly campaign as anti-human? Before the Battle of the Citadel, the alien population thought we were violent upstarts. Look what's happened since then. A human fleet guarding the station for months? C-Sec filled with humans? Anderson does what he can, but some people have lived on the station since before humans had starships. They see it as a coup. I don't give a damn what Joram's politics are. This is about Thane's son, not him. You might not care, but the people who live here do. Sergeant, get a patrol car. These two need to get to the 800 blocks. Yes, sir. There he is. How do you want to play this? Follow to lead on the maintenance catwalks. Tell me what he's doing. The Krogan bodyguard will make him easy to follow. Where will you be? the darkest corner with the best view. I'm on Kira, Lord of Hunters. Grant that my hands be steady, my aim be true, and my feet swift. And should the worst come to pass, grant me forgiveness. It's been wonderful talking with you all. I hope you'll come out on election day.
You can count on him. I'm on him, Thane. He's talking to some voters. Understood. You're in position? Yes. It's been wonderful talking with you all. I hope you'll come out on election day. Looks like he's talking to another voter. Any sign of call yet? No. I'm moving to another position. Ahead of him. It's been wonderful talking with you all. I hope you'll come out on election day. One of his guards is talking to the bartender. Looks like a shake. No sign of trouble. Where is he now? He's meeting a couple of mercenaries. Looks like the same group his bodyguard comes from. He looks nervous. Could be he's noticed you. Maybe he saw Kolyad in here somewhere. Sir. Yes, sir. Hey, who are you? I don't have time for this. department. Put the gun down, son. Get out of my way. I'm walking out. He's coming with me. They'll have snipers outside. I don't need your help. 
What the hell? Talib, get the hell out of here. Yeah, yeah, I will. Take the boy into custody. You son of a bitch! Your father and I have killed a lot of people. You haven't. There's no reason you should start. I read his files. What made it all right for him to kill all those years? I was six when the Hanar began to train me. I didn't know any better. Your mother woke me from my battle sleep. Then why did you leave her? Why weren't you there when she died? Your mother... They killed her to get to me. It was my fault. What? After her body was given to the Deep, I went to find them. The Trigger Men, the Ringleaders. I hurt them. Eventually killed them. When I went back to see you, you were... older. I should have stayed with you. I guess it's too bad for me you waited so long, huh? Kolyat, I've taken many bad things out of the world. You're the only good thing I ever added to it. This isn't a conversation you should have in front of strangers. Boys, take Kolyat and his father back to the precinct. Give them a room and as much time as they need. I'm surprised you're letting him do that. You think he's the only man who ever screwed up raising a son? I have to get back to the precinct. Come on, I'll give you a lift. Kid's been through a lot. I ran some searches in the CSAC archive. About ten years back, a bunch of real bad people were killed. Like someone was cleaning house. The prime suspect was a drill. We never caught him. Ten years is a long time. Whoever was responsible for that probably doesn't exist anymore. Yeah, I guess you're right about that. Go. Our problems are... They aren't something I can fix with a few words. We'll keep talking, see what happens. Your boy shot some people. No one I feel sympathy for, but there it is. I watched those guys shaking down businesses and threatening humans. But he can't just get away with it. The kid wants to make a difference. Give him community service. Community service for attempted murder? What jury would agree to that? None that I've seen. This would need to stay out of the judiciary, strictly within CSEC. Interesting. I'll think about it. Thank you, Captain. <laughs> 